And welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with yet another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am, as always, the Terran. This this time I'm blue in the southwest corner up against Dark Star. The red Protoss in the northeast. Um, I tell him good luck, have fun. He says cool. Um, not quite sure what that's about. Um, he's going for a fast pylon here. Not sure what's going on. Um, sent one of his first drones out, um, probes, sorry, um, they have probes, sent one of his first probes out, uh, to scout my base, um, not quite sure why, there's no way I could have any type of force this early into the game, um, and it really just removes minerals, still not chrono boosting anything, he's going for a forge, uh, checking out the high yield expansion, just just looking at the rocks there. They're so pretty. With that gray stuff. Um, he does get a forge uh, down before gateways. That typically means that he's going to be getting cannons. Um, forges are great. Um, that's where you get the upgrades. Uh, but you need them to get the cannons. Uh, and I can see now that he's getting cannons. Uh, still not chrono boosting anything. He has full energy on that Nexus and no uh, rally point on it. Um, and probes just kind of hanging out all over the map. Uh, there goes my SCV. Does he make it? No, not even close. Uh, checking out my expansion. Uh, trying to make sure I don't do a fast expansion. He does come up. I do get a. Mer I am training mass marines because he did send that um, probe in so fast. Um, I assume that he's be he's going in for some kind of rush. But as you can see, I'm clearly taking a huge lead on the harvester count, 15 to 9 this early into the game, as he's just sealing off with pylons. No, none of these are cannons. Um, just just the one cannon, just mass pylons. So as you can see, he, he's. 10 out of 50 um, training probes but not using them um, as you can see he doesn't have any hotkeys uh, that's so important for this game uh, if you want to play at all competitively I use them constantly and I still can't get out of the bronze league I am getting better at it though don't worry just takes time I am going uh, Looks like th three barracks, three barracks, and an engineering bay. Um, trying to go uh, my marine marauder medevacs because it, it's worth so. Uh, I haven't lost yet any time that I've gotten it up. Uh, we are starting to see um, the photon cannon going down. He does block off the base, uh, the the ramp. I'm not sure why against uh, Terran. There's really not a need to be doing that. I, I have no melee units, and I can get a Reaper just as early as I can get just about anything else except Marines and hop up here anyways. Don't know uh, the point of the uh, block off there. Uh, the gateway is up. He does not morph it into a warp gate yet. Going for the, the Zealot first. Uh, once again, just a uh, probe standing there. We're looking at it at the same time, uh, but he doesn't have nearly enough minerals to be starting an expansion. Because um, as you can see here, he's only got 10 probes on uh, minerals and not chrono boosting still full energy on that Nexus. I, on the other hand, have... Uh, looks like I got one on gas. So I've got 16 SCVs and a mule. Um, I... And I'm still not going, I'm not even thinking about the fast expansion yet. The expansion, sorry, this wouldn't be fast at this point. But I do Psylocke myself. Ugh, I'm so bad at that. Supply depots, you know, I, I think they're worthless, but so I don't think about getting them. I'm like, oh, you know, I need barracks, I need barracks, uh, you know, factory or starport. I don't always think, well, <laughs> that's not going to do me any good without a... Um, without supply depots. I do build a sensor tower. Simply because I saw it in the last game. No other reason than that, to be honest with you. Um, the, one of the previous games that I played, I, I did see somebody get a sensor tower, so I figure, hey, I'll take a look, see how it works out for me. Um, I don't remember how much it actually costs to build. Uh, 
So, <laughs> but it, it's not worth it. Don't even bother. Uh, the Nexus is up uh, on the expansion. Um, but he, he doesn't have nearly enough drones to do any sort of transfer. He needs more drones. Sorry, probes. I keep calling them drones. Um, doesn't really matter what they're called, to be honest with you. He needs more harvesters on his main base. Um, really, his, his only defense at this point... Let's see, is there an army tab? There we go. Um, he's only got two units. Two zealots and 15 probes. And uh, I might be able to take that army out with just my SCVs, but I do have 12 marines, 7 marauders out. I'm finally going for that expansion. I uh, feel it's pretty safe at this point, but I do fear a, another Protoss rush. Um, I'm getting quite a big um, difference in uh, the harvesters here. Almost double. Um, I've got 30, he's got 17. He is training more at the expansion. That's not the best strategy. You don't want to start all over with an expansion. You want to have probes ready to move over to the expansion to get that up. He's now just getting the Cybernetics Core. It's so late in the game to be getting the Cybernetics Core. Without that, you can't get the Sentry or the Stalkers uh, Zealots by themselves against um, any sort of Terran Force isn't going to be doing that great. Um, they, Even though they are the most expensive, uh, they're just not cost-effective against uh, Marines especially if they're paired up with Marauders, and they do have upgrades like I do. Uh, stim pack, uh, one zero upgrades, one on the weapon zero on upgrades on the um, armor. So, what else is going on in this game? Pylon going down. Oh, I do see two um, photon cannons. I'm focusing those down, then taking out the pylons. Uh, this is really why the uh, lock off against the Terran just isn't that great of a strategy. Um, I, you know, all these guys have range. Um, I didn't really need to stem pack, but I did anyways. I moved in before I got the medevacs out. Um, as you can see, that was a pretty good move on my part. He is sending the army in, and there you go. Um, Zealot's just not doing that great. Uh, only taking out one, even though they already are low on health. And I don't know it at this point, but I've already won the game, so I just need to move these guys in, and it's game over. Uh, he's only got one cannon up, so but I do give him time to bring out more. Um, he does have a stalker out, uh, just hanging out right now, so he's bringing in more photon cannons. If I could see that, I'd be moving in, um, but I'm waiting for those medevacs. Um, to heal everybody up so I can send in my reinforcements, everybody in full health, stim pack, hopefully those uh, medevacs can heal up. As you can see, they don't move that fast, uh, but they move fast enough uh, for me to feel uh, safe making another push. So I do try to take out those. Oh, do take out two cannons. Looks like I haven't lost anybody yet. And the game keeps going. Taking out, oh, one stalker, one zealot, another photon can does get up. How many shots? One, two, three, down. Three shots. Uh, game over um, for Darkstar. I already forgot his name, sorry. Is a kind of cool name, actually. Uh, very uh, Star Wars-esque. And here's where I find out, oh, you've got another base. <laughs> Your probes have to be going somewhere. Um, but I'm not too concerned about it. Oh, I should have let them keep going. But he does leave the game before I, uh, it goes on too far. Just take a quick look around. Uh, he is warping in a gateway, but once again, just poor saturation on the minerals. Spelled Doom for Dark Star. I found the one weakness. It's not a Death Star, it's a Dark Star. <laughs> Alright, see you guys next time.